hi ladies and gentlemen welcome back to our channel and guys today we have uh, some breaking news which are sad uh, guys uh to memporteza mr machoka uh from nyamache nyamache mati matierio nyamache matierio ni matierio ama ni matirio uh na uko kisi Imagine wamemtoa macho tena. Wa, wa, watu watu sijui tutawatoa kisi tuwapeleke Saudi Arabia ama kisi sijui ni kama imekuwa capital city ya Saudi Arabia. Imagine tulikuwa na kesi ya Baby Sagin alikuwa ametolewa macho yote mbili. Saa hii mwalimu Machoka wamemtoa macho tena. And uh, I don't know whether you guys you are thinking uh, what I'm trying to think. Um, history ya baby sagin ilikuja tu ikaletwa hivi alafu akaikanyagia chini. Ujue serikali yetu imeoza. Ju kama serikali serikali yetu ya Kenya ingekuwa genuine wangefuatilia hiyo kesi waone ni nani walitoa macho na macho ilipelekwa wapi. Ju that is that was a serious case. Imagine after baby Sagini kutolewa macho si kuna huyo mzee alitolewa na hiyo story wakakanyagia chini. Sasa Mr. Machoka ambaye ni mwalimu wamemtoa macho. Wa Kenya mimi najiuliza kwani kuna biashara inaendelea Kenya ya macho na wasemi. Na remember story ya baby Sagini ilikuwa inasemekana ati macho zimepelekwa sijui kanisani. Although they did not identify the church, your story ilikuja ikakanyagiwa chini. Ndio maana nasema wakisi wenye wamebaki pale Kenya and I'm sorry to say this. Na usilalamike jusi wewe umetoana macho. Ju that is a serious case guys. Imagine huku Saudi tunatolewa kidney private part, tunatolewa meno, mapua, kila kitu. Hmm? Sasa mbona tusitoe watu huko kisi? wakuja hapa nini wakuja wasaidia hawa waarabu kutoa hizo viungo vya mwili ama tuwakurudishe Congo Forest Ebu guys niambieni vile tutakuja kufanya hata ujui rafiki yako ni nani hapo kisi na kwanza Kenya sijui ni nini inaendelea imagine kama uko golf na wewe ni mkisi be very careful ju you either ufike pale Kenya capital city of Nairobi either upate gonorrhea ama uende kisi utolewe macho ai wa kisi jamani this is too much guys unajua mnashindanga kuniambia why all kisi why kila siku kisi lakini si mnaona zile vitu zinafanyika huko unajua mimi na nalumulikanga kila mahali hmm? it is so sad yani kuona mwalimu machoka he is no more Unajua once he was in Qatar ndio maana nimeleta hiyo story yake hapa. Wamemtoa macho vibaya sana guys. Na by the way guys in case you have not subscribed, subscribe. Unajua pale kisi unaweza kuwa na rafiki wale wa kisi genuine wenye wameokoka wenye wamebaki wakisi wote wenye wako gulf saa hii au wakisi ndio nataka warudishwe Kenya na wakisi wote wenye wako Kenya pale nyamache huko kisi yote nyamira whatever waletwe hapa Saudi Arabia wasaidiane na Waarabu kutoa kidini kutoa macho aki at least Kenya yetu ipumzike ju sasa kama baby sagini kesi yake bado ime iko pending hii ni kesi nyingine imetokelezea as if in Kenya we don't have DCI DCIs eh why why is this all happening Yaani hata wewe uwezi kujua kama ni wewe utakuwa next. Imagine unaamka tu hivi ukiwa mzima. Mr. Machoka alikuwa amekosea wapi shwali? Mr. Machoka alikuwa amekosea nani? Hata kama alikuwa amekosea nani, he didn't deserve all this. Imagine unatolewa macho una, unakaa gakuka ga kanini. Ka Ona vile tu alikuwa muanti sam. Huyu he was a father of someone he was a, a grandson to someone he was a, you know a brother to someone eh alikuwa mtoto wa mtu leo hii ametolewa macho maybe hata ametolewa na marafiki zake uwezi unaona by the way tuongee ukweli ukiwa pale kisi uwezi unaamka tu 
Unaamka hata huwezi jua kama watakuja kukuku. Kukujia hiyo macho yako hapo kwa background yenu. Ama ni ukienda kwa cho. Ama ni ukienda hapo kwa kasoko. Ama ni ukienda hapo kwa shop. Ama maybe ukienda kuchota maji. Kwa hapo kamutokenu hapo. He? Eh? Hata ukienda ni unaogopa hata kuendanisha na mtoto wako. Jumunaiza tolewa macho nyinyi wote. Hmm? Ebu tuonge tuki, tukiongopa tu Mungu. Uh, kama baby Sagini kesi yake iko pending. Ule 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 muguka wa kuongelelea story yake na alitolewa tu macho yote mbili. Huyu ni Mr. Machoka, mumejionea ametolewa macho yake yote mbili. Hmm? Ame, alikuwa amekosea nani? Ndio Yaani ndio afanyiwe hii unyama. Yaani yani ni wapi macho zinauzwa Kenya? Na kwani hizo macho zinauzwa na pesa ngapi? Na mbona? Yaani Kenya yetu shwali. Ilikosa tu kufuatilia kesi ya baby Sagini. Hmm? Unajua baby Sagini ako afadhali juu yeye ako hai. Lakini huyu alikuwa baba wa mtu, lakini wamemutoa macho na wakamuua. Macho imepelekwa wapi jamani? Hmm? Yani it is a very painful story You guys you might think I'm joking But in real Inaniuma sana Wakisi this is too much Na nimesema isikume kama wewe siyo mkisi Na ukikomenda hapa ujua tutakupeleka uko Saudi Arabia Uka uwendo uka Uka saidiane na warabu kutoa Manini Maroza watu uko Manyo Manini mafigo za watu uko Do it is only in Saudi Arabia where private spa, ah sorry where the parts of body are being uh, you know uh, vested but hii ujinga yenye imeanza Kenya kisi eh? I don't know where we are ending hata wewe unaogopa mtoto wako akienda shule maybe atakutana nao watu wenye wana nini wanatoa macho watu na um, um, unajua huyo mtu hata alikuwa hapo after after huyo nini kuwa hawa watu ni kama kwani macho moja inatoka milioni ngapi na kwani wanatoa mtu macho aje how does it start imagine uko strong enough ukitembea how does it start Una, unajipata uko tortured how does it start yani it is very painful unajua wewe ebu imagine umeamka tu ukiwa mzima pale Kenya kisi nyamache Nasikia matiero, mematierio ama ni matirio. Umeamka ukiwa mzima, una, unapatana na watu, unatolewa jicho moja, ukisikia hiyo uchungu, unatolewa macho ingine. Eh? The story of baby again, which me, enye ilinifanya ni kalia jamani. Eh? Something must be done to our country. Guys, I want you to comment at the comment section in case you are from Nyamache County. Comment at the comment section in case you are from Matierio. Comment at the comment section and tell us what you want us to do with this KC. Eh? Ukue unatoka Gusiland, Nyamira, Nyamache. As long as we are in KC, we need to talk privately. So that we can solve what is happening in our country. And please pray every day for your family, for your friends. Yeah, tuombe ane kabisa. Tuombe inji yetu. Something is happening. Sijui macho zinapeleko hapi. Bye.